Hi, I'm Alex, your AdStars assistant. Welcome to AdStars, follow along step by step, or click on the chapter you want to explore more for the quickest way to display your review stars next to your web pages on Google's organic search results. From the home page of AdStars.com, click on the pricing button. You'll scroll down to the AdStars plans, decide on which plan is best for you and click select this plan. Complete all the field, ticking the I acknowledge I have read and understand the terms and conditions box and hit the sign up button. Now add your card details and importantly, select your country, as this determines the sales tax or VAT that you pay. Finally, click the subscribe button. Now you're on the welcome page of your dashboard. This is your welcome page which will help you with setup. This is the navigation bar, with links to your dashboard, all the available review platforms, and by clicking on account, you have your account details listed in a dropdown. The information on the welcome page is important, so please read it, and it's important to note that you need to connect your platforms before you add your account ID to your website. The dashboard link lets you find out what platforms you have connected to, how many reviews you have, and links to add new platforms, the AdStars knowledge base and contacting support. The reviews platforms is where you connect your review to your dashboard. You can either type your platform name into the search box or scroll down to find the platform you want to connect to. By clicking on accounts. Account settings are where you can enter or edit your details. Security is your password manager with the option to change it. The billing account link shows your current plan, payment method, and invoice history. You can also download your receipts. The roadmap link opens a new window, this shows you what AdStars is working towards. And lastly, Logout speaks for itself. You will always return to the welcome page by clicking on the welcome link in the navigation bar. In the middle of the welcome page is a green button. If you have asked your web developer to install AdStars on your behalf, share your dashboard sign-in details and let them know that the green button is for them. The two blue buttons show you how to connect your review platforms. This must be done before connecting your AdStars dashboard with your website. The buttons are a walkthrough video and a readable or downloadable document. This is how to connect your review platforms so that Google can find them and link them to your web pages in Google's search results. It's important to note, you have to connect your platforms before adding the AdStars code to your website. The reason is, if Google crawls your website before the platforms are connected, it has no data to read, so no stars to display, so let's dive in. Start by clicking Review Platforms in the navigation bar. This page is where you'll find the list of platforms you can choose from. You can either find your review platforms by typing the name in the Find a Review Platform search box, or you can scroll down the page to find it. Next to each of the platforms is an Enable Disable switch, and next to the platform you want to connect, toggle the switch to blue to enable it. Each platform has a short video that can help with installation. Alternatively, hover over the information icons, and you can get further help. Once you've added your details into the name and location fields, click the Save Integrations button, and you're ready to connect another platform. You can connect to as many platforms as are available. If you have another branch or location that you want to aggregate reviews from, click the Request to Add a New Location button, as you will need to add an additional license, and AdStars will combine the totals of your combined platforms for display on your website. Then, once you've added and saved all your platforms, click the blue Installation Script and Account ID button at the top of the page. Depending on how your website is built, copy the script or your user ID using the blue copy link. Now you can add your script or ID to your website. For more information on adding your script or ID to your website, visit help.adstars.io and click on How to Install AdStars. Here you'll find a video on how to add your AdStars user ID to WordPress using the AdStars plugin, along with links to popular CMSs. If you are unsure about touching the code on your website, 
the simplest way would be to forward your welcome email to your web developer. Once they log in, they can click the green button on the welcome page to learn how to connect AdStars to your website. Once completed and AdStars has been installed on your website, Google will take a few days to recognize the changes and start displaying your reviews. If you get stuck or want help, we offer a one-to-one -one onboarding service, reach out using the chat box at the bottom right of your dashboard, and we'll make sure you get set up to succeed with AdStars. And remember, for best results, clear the cache on your website. Once you're logged into your dashboard, click the Add New Plugin link in the left-hand sidebar. Click Add New and search for AdStars. When you see it, click Install. Once the AdStars plugin has been installed, click Activate, and you will see you can configure the plugin using the link at the top of the screen. A new screen will open where you can add your AdStars user ID. Head back to your AdStars dashboard, click the blue installation script and account ID button and copy the lower box using the blue copy button. Returning to your WordPress dashboard, paste your ID into the user ID box and click save. If you don't want to use the AdStars plugin, you may want a more anonymous method of adding the script, head back to the Add New Plugin page and search for your favorite header footer code manager. I searched header footer and there are plenty to choose from. I selected header footer code manager and then installed and activated it. Head back to your AdStars dashboard, click the blue installation script and account ID button and copy the upper box, which is the complete script, using the blue copy button. On your WordPress dashboard, name the snippet and paste the script into the header and click Save. To confirm the code is there, visit the home page, right-click anywhere on the site, and select View Source from the drop-down. This will show you the page code. Now click Ctrl F, and in the search box, type in AdStars which will highlight the word. Now you can see the code has been added to your website's header. Lastly, some top tips. Connect your platforms first. Clear your website's cache and maybe use a plugin like Clear Cache for me. Sign up to the Google Search Console and re-index your website so Google can start to show your hard-earned review stars. A good starting point is to search YouTube for Google Search Console setup, how to get started for beginners, and follow along to the video. If you need help, reach out to us using the chat box on your dashboard. We offer a one-to-one -one onboarding service so that you can succeed with AdStars.